Unit 5. Task 7. 1. Mr. Gumley. Mr. Gumley, you'll have to have some investigations done to find out exactly what's causing your problem. Firstly, we need to get your chest x-rayed. Then for three mornings running, I'd like you to bring to the surgery a sample of the phlegm that you cough up in the morning. We'll be sending that off to the lab for testing to see if you have any particular germs present. Following that, it'll be necessary for you to have a bronchoscopy done. This is an investigation which involves looking down into your lungs through a tube. We'll have to admit you to hospital for the day to do it. It's not a particularly pleasant investigation, but you'll be given an anaesthetic spray before the tube is passed down into your lungs. Usually it doesn't take more than a few minutes, but it may last longer if they need to take samples of the tissue in your lungs, maybe up to 20 minutes. You have to take this test with an empty stomach, so you won't have any breakfast that day. You'll be able to get home again after the test, but you'll have to wait until the anaesthetic has worn off before you eat anything. 2. Mrs Emma Sharp uh, Because of your heavy periods, Mrs Sharp, we must find out if you've become anemic, so I'll have to take a blood test. Oh, right. Uh, I think it will also be necessary for you to have a D&C done in hospital. We can probably do this as a day case. Good. It's a very simple procedure and just involves removing a small piece of the lining from inside the womb to find out why your periods have become so heavy. Mm -hmm. It'll also give us a better chance to examine you under the anaesthetic. It might also be necessary to do a pelvic ultrasonograph. This is a very simple test, which takes a special picture of the lower end of your abdomen to see if the womb is enlarged. 3. Miss Grace Donaldson. From your symptoms, it would seem that you have an overactive thyroid gland. We can test this quite simply by doing a blood test to check the level of hormones in your blood. 4. Mr Pritt. Because you've been having this trouble with abdominal pain after fatty foods, I think you may have some stones in your gallbladder. You will need to have a special X-ray done. This is called a cholecystogram, and it will involve you taking some tablets before attending the X-ray department. They'll take an ordinary X-ray first, and then give you something fatty to eat, after which they'll take pictures of the gallbladder area to see if your gallbladder is working properly and if there are any stones present. They may also do an ultrasonograph. This is a way of examining your abdomen using a special machine which can show us pictures of your stomach and gallbladder using sound signals. It's not painful at all, and it doesn't take more than five or ten minutes to perform. 5. Barry Scott Mrs Scott, I feel certain that Barry has German measles. Sometimes we do a blood test to prove this definitely. But because he is only two and a half, I am sure he wouldn't like to have a blood test done, and it would be safer to do nothing. 6. Mrs Mary Locke Mrs Locke, I think it's possible that you have a condition called glaucoma, which is caused by increased pressure inside the eye. In order to prove this, it will be necessary for you to have the pressure inside your eyes measured. We use a small instrument with a scale on it to measure the pressure. We'll put a few drops of local anaesthetic on your eye so you shouldn't feel anything. The test only takes a few seconds.